Hello and welcome to the second part of my review of the Russian Army 24 hours IRP menu number 5. Due to some technical reasons uh, there is one more item here which is entree which is the beef stew which is already heating and I will show it a little bit later. What do we have here? Peach flavor drink, vitamin drink Crackers full corn flour, Pamiliski Galiety, Ikla is Ovoshti, this is a kind of vegetable stew which is made of zucchini, a huge pack of sugar, 20 grams, black tea, and the moist toilet. Uh, I used the portable stove to heat up the entree, which I will show a little bit later. First, let's start with the drinks. This is the normal standard tea. And the peach drink, this is also made in Russia. Should be dissolved in 200 milliliters of water, cold water. I have a sparkling mineral water, that's probably this piece coming, give it a stir. Okay, then we have the crackers. These crackers have a shelf life of two years. And this vegetable stew, it's also made in Russia. It's a little bit runny, smells very nice. Uh, we have here the zucchini, uh, carrots, um, onions, salt, um, sugar and the tomato paste. We'll put a little bit of this on a cracker because it is supposed to be eaten like that. Okay, the entry is ready. It took one tablet, fuel tablet and 12 to 15 minutes to prepare it. The tablet has burned out and this is really hot. This is a beef stew. Okay, uh, it contains beef, uh, beef fat, uh, onions um, and some spices, I would say. 56% um, of mm, the meat and, and the fat and this has uh, not so much calories uh, because it is uh, 213 calories. Great, I will put it in a bowl. Wow, 
It's a big one, big chunk of meat. You can see the bay leaf on the top. There is a little bit of jelly inside because it's not melted. Okay, well, let's taste it. I will add a little bit of sugar. Not the whole pack because it's four uh, teaspoons. It will kill me. Just a bit. Okay. Let's taste the crackers. Yeah. Just like the other ones which were included in breakfast set, this is quite neutral like a bread I would say. Not very salty, not sweet, not anything. That's good. Now let's taste the ikra. It's a nice tomato smell. It's a little bit bland, but it's tasty. With a little bit of this uh, salt and pepper, it would be definitely good. Now I will try the peach drink. It smells a little bit artificial peach. It's, it's not bad. It's a little bit sweet. The sugar has not dissolved. But yeah, it's nice. It's, it, it's a good taste. Now let's try the serious thing. Yeah. The meat is not processed. So this this is really chunks of meat, big chunks of meat. Oh, that's good. Really, it's it's fat. It's fatty, but it has a meat flavor. Really tastes beef. You don't have uh, to give this any spices, it's salty. You can taste a little bit of this bay leaf. That's good, I recommend it. And let's taste the tea. It's quite decent, just normal standard tea, but I had also I've had I've had worse than this. But it's quite good. That this was the lunch. This is the last part of the re review. This is the dinner. The main dish here is the um, stew with potatoes. This is a beef stew, Gulyas Kartofilim, and it contains uh, beef, of course, uh, potato, beef fat, uh, tomato paste, uh, carrots. Uh, salt, sugar, and onion, yeah, and some other spices, and also uh, oil, sunflower oil. We have also the kind of uh, pork spam, and uh, this is literally fagsko basni. This means uh, uh, sausage. Stuffing. This is something like inside of, of the sausage. In addition to this, we have spitzelienning. This is uh, pork fat. 
just salted. We have also melted processed cheese, silk pavienne. And we have of course our crackers. And this is the apple puree. And the drink, and this time I chosen the raspberry drink. Big pack of sugar. Black tea. Moist towel. Gum, salt and pepper, and the water purification tablet. Okay, let's start with heating up the entree. I will use the portable stove, which was used also for the lunch, and take another fuel tablet. I will punch this can. Some holes. Okay, and start the fire. One match is normally enough. Just wait a little bit. Oops, this time one match is not enough. Okay, I guess. Yeah, this has started to burn, so we'll put the entree on the stove. The entree is heating, so let's start with the other items. First the tea, this is uh, Ceylon tea, black tea. This time I will make the tea without the sugar, so the way I normally do. And I will put it in a transparent glass to show the color. Additionally to this we have uh, the crackers Let's put it here and we have uh, other items First is this uh, Fargs Kobasni which is uh, kind of pork spam sausage spam and it is produced in Russia and contains uh, uh, beef, pork, fat and some spices. Let's open this. Yeah, it's quite processed. Whoops. It's minced fine way. I will put a little bit on a cracker. Okay, then this melted processed cheese. Um, yes, it's also made in Russia, so it's really pure Russian ration. It's a little bit yellow, pale, or whatever. It's very soft, as you can see. I'll put it on another cracker. Then we have this apple puree, which is uh, also made in Russia and contains, guess what? Apples, just apples. So it's very fine content. 
it looks really nice just like apple puree yeah, it's a little bit runny okay the last thing which is which remains is this pork fat spit solieni conservigavani well it contains uh, pork fat and salt and of course it's made in Russia so let's open this you can see we have uh, pork fat pieces here so this is probably can be added to the entree or just eaten with the crackers it's quite soft yeah it's soft it's surprisingly so I will put this a little bit on the cracker and maybe I will add then to the entree we have also another drink which is the raspberry vitamin drink uh, how should it be open it's also of course made in Russia it's not that easy I have to help myself with some scissors. Okay. And it's for 200 milliliters of water. We'll give it a stir. After about 10 minutes the entree is ready, so let's make some space here for this. Yeah, it's really hot. It's 250 grams looks like this oops hot 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 pot right so that's the whole ration and start, let's start the tasting so first start with the crackers the crackers are the same so our taste this uh, sausage spam or something mm. it doesn't look so good because it's really minced but it tastes like a sausage really with I can taste the garlic it's, it's really tasty then the melted processed cheese it's normal melted cheese like we can buy in the shops here but yeah it has a taste so it's not like a really bland it's quite good. Let's try this raspberry drink. Mmm, it's nice. It's better than the peach one because that that one was really artificial, and this is kind of natural. Yeah, it's good. Okay, so maybe let's taste now the pork fat. This is something which actually you cannot eat by itself, but in some on some occasions you can. It's very soft. It's um, uh, salty, a little bit salty and fatty. So this is something 
what I could expect from this. So uh, for people which are not used to this kind of stuff, like us, this can be a little bit weird, but we know this taste. So now to the entree. You can hear, you can see here a lot of potatoes, quite big chunks of meat, and maybe a little bit of vegetables like small carrot pieces, a little bit of, of gravy. Mm, times to taste. Yeah, it has a nice combination of uh, meaty flavor and uh, potato stew, so baked, boiled potatoes. Maybe it needs a little bit of salt. So I will put a little bit of crackers here to do the gandok style and to do the Russian style. I will put some of this pork fat. Okay, let's taste it together. Yeah, the crackers really add some crunchiness, so it's really nice taste. The pork fat maybe not so much. Yeah, but that's okay. So let's taste the tea. Yeah, it's 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 quite good. It's um, has really the taste of the tea, which is not in every case. And what is left here is the apple puree, maybe this one, it's a little bit runny. Wow, it's 100% apple puree, it's just like you would take an apple, warm it up and it falls apart in, into this kind of puree. It's very good, it's very natural, no sugars, no preservatives, thumbs up for this one. So, thank you very much for watching this review, subscribe my channel for the next reviews. Have a good time, hi!